This coming Sunday, the 13th of May, is Mother's Day. Time to spoil your moms. We'll be doing Arbor to Lead SA this coming Sunday with a table of peace and unity. Myself and my fellow breakfast show host, Kino Kamis from 567 Cape Talk, will be out hosting this annual event, which aims to raise awareness around various organizations this year within the city. Organizations that are in bad need of financial help and other forms of help. I'm a future fighter, which is a child um, born from the foundation. The foundation is the Desmond Tutu HIV Foundation Youth Center. Um, the great thing about the foundation is that now it's, it has the young aspect of things. We are young, we are hip, and they know exactly how to serve us. If there's anything that I enjoy most that the, that the foundation provides is the fact that we have our own space. I live in a community where everything is cluttered. I live in a community where a young person's voice is never recognized. I live in a community where I'm oppressed of what my needs are and what the foundation provides for me is just basically what I would like. My own space, a space to learn, a space to make my own choices. Thank you to you all. Thank you for taking the time. Thank you for at least recognizing because I know, you know what, you've given us a lot just by giving us your time. I look after our homeless children, adults, uh, teenagers who haven't got a place, people chase, the, chase them away and they got nowhere to go and if they come and knock on my door, I give them a place to sleep, a warm plate of food. Today I want to say thank you to Peace, to, to Table of Peace and Unity. We're looking for the children in Ngatulundu Sanctuary Trust, zero to 13, up to 14 years. Our children, it's a normal children, abandoned children, blind children, HIV children, mentally children, and we do the program for them. I want to say thank you for the money they gave to us last year. I want to say thank you, Danki and Kos, Akulu, 